Kto ty jesteś, Polak mały? Jaki znak twój, orzeł biały? Gdzie ty mieszkasz, Polsk między swymi? W jakim kraju, w polskiej ziemi? Czem ta ziemia, mą ojczyzną? Czem zdobyta krwią i blizną? Czy ją kochasz? Kocham szczerze, a w co wierzysz? Polskie wierzę. Płynie Wisła, płynie po polskiej krainie, po polskiej krainie. My story krainie. starts in Zobaczyła 1939 in Krajewo, a small town in Poland. Just before World War II, I was 16 and full of life. Things changed one day. I was getting ready to school when the bombs start to fall. Many people don't know that in the beginning of the war, Russia and Germany had agreed to divide Poland among themselves. My mother told us the war was coming, but no one expected it so, so soon. Because my father was chief of police, he was one of the first to be arrested by Russian soldiers. We never saw him again. My brother Victor followed soon after. The Germans burned our house down, and the Russian soldiers give us only 20 minutes before they loaded us in a train like animals, head to Siberia. We were destined to die. My mother brought dry bread and ham for journey. Late the night, soldiers stop the train and give us water from to drink from engine. I spent one winter and one summer in Kazakhstan. During that time, I almost die of starvation and illness. Those who stay in the Kazakhstan another winter all die. One day we are told that Hitler attacked Russia and we are free to fight the Germans. We walk to Tehran in Iran. Okay. My sister and I had to share a pair of shoes. When we arrived, I joined the Polish army. I was immediately sent to Iraq for basic training. It's hard to describe how proud I felt when they first gave me a uniform. I was convoy truck driver. My job was driving ammunition supply and soldiers to the front line. I will never forget the battle of Monte Cassino in Italy. Monte Cassino was the last German stronghold. It was a proud victory for us. The war ended shortly after that, but my journey was far from over. I got married two days after the war ended and started family. My son Andrew was born in Italy. We shared flood with four families in London. Life was difficult. Finally, we decided to go to America. When I saw the Statue of Liberty, all I could do was cry. It was a chance to start off. The Russian gave us only 20 minutes before they loaded us into... <laughs> Kero. Cars. You see, that's it's hard to. Oh my gosh. The Germans burn our house down, and the Russian soldiers give us only 20 minutes before.